Hello everyone, Yosef Gaming here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get all the stars and stamps in Super Mario World 3D for World 2. Now we're going to start off on level 1, um, we're going to grab this bell power and we're going to actually climb up here with our cat-like feeling powers and grab that green star. For the second one we're going to use this dodo bird and have him destroy the block, and there's your second green star. Now for the third green star, it's pretty simple, we're just going to destroy this guy and Toad is so kind, he'll give us the green star. And Toad, can I have that star now? Thank you very much. Now we're going to grab the stamp after this. This guy, but it's time to be found right next to the green star, the third one, and there it is. So that's everything for level one. Now we're gonna move on to level two. Um, this one's kind of difficult. You have to use your Wii pad and you have to touch things, and it's kind of weird and disgusting. But you're gonna grab the green star right up there. For the second one, we're gonna go over to this, and we're gonna blow on our Wii U, which is kind of strange. And we're gonna go up into the clouds. So we're gonna boost right up there to the clouds, and we're gonna run across this area. Now we're gonna grab the star power because stars are awesome. And we're gonna move, and we're gonna move, we're gonna move. And as soon as we get to the end, there you can find your star. So we're gonna keep going here. Running all, through all this stuff, getting time, getting one-ups and all that fun stuff, and eventually grab our green star. So that's the second one. Now for the third one, this one's kind of difficult. You're going to have to use your Wii pad again, and you're going to have to touch it again. So you're going to have to touch it, touch it, touch it again, and you're going to start blowing on it. So you're going to touch and blow at the same time, and you're just going to wait. You're going to keep blowing and blowing and blowing and blowing, and then you'll finally get what you wanted you'll get your third green star, which is right down there. You're gonna have to blow your way back up, but now we're gonna move on to the stamp. The stamp can be found at the beginning of the level, but you're gonna go underneath this little weird thing, and you're gonna touch your Wii again, your Wii U pad, you're gonna touch it again, and it's gonna bring you up to your stamp. And now we're moving on to the next level. So level three, um, it's a little it's a little easy, a little hard here and there, but the first one is kind of strange because it's actually like in the depths. And then we're gonna grab the second one. Um, the second one's actually in between these weird purple fuzzy things. You're gonna have to color everything on the, on the third one, which is not too soon but we're gonna hit that there and the second star can be found right underneath kind of like a shadow game shadow realm Yu-Gi-Oh! just kidding anyway we're gonna go back here and there's a bowser another shadow yeah another shadow we're gonna destroy bowser now how do you destroy bowser oh wait bowser a piece of paper a piece of cardboard whatever total then again then again give you the star and happy birthday to you because there's your star all right now we're gonna move on to the stamp the stamp was kind of difficult for me i actually had to look it up because this one was hard so you actually have to use your cat power and crawl underneath it and there's boxes and you get your stamp it's that simple now we're going to the stamp house stamp house is pretty simple you walk in you get your stamp you leave just like that. Now we're gonna move on to level four. Level four, the first stamp can be found, or the first star, my apologies, can be found up there. The second one's pretty easy as well. Um, you just go through the pipe, and this is where it gets colorful. That's what I was referring to. Pretty much just to color everything. You can use the baseballs as well to cover, um, to color everything if you'd like. But pretty much you gotta make everything beautiful, play a dance dance revolution or whatever you'd like on these little blocks. I happen to get all of them but one, which is in the corner. But I eventually get them all, and then they'll give us our star at the top of the ladder. So let me color these all up. Get rid of that Goomba. I'm just kidding. All right, there's your green star. And there's your second one. So we're gonna grab that right now by climbing up these stairs. And once we get that, then we're gonna move on to our third green star and then the stamp for level four. All right, let's go to the third star. The third star is actually kind of funny. Um, if you were happen to fail, you can just fall and get your green star right there. Towards the end of the level, towards the last pipe. Now we're gonna get the stamp. You actually have to be Mario, so that's how you get that stamp at the beginning of the level. Um, and now we're gonna go um, to the stamp house again. But this is different. I call this the stamp house because you pretty much just go through there and destroy everything. Same thing with 2A, you just destroy it and you get the star. So pretty much it's an easy six. Um, for level five, you're gonna grab it in the corner right there next to the pipe. Um, you're gonna need two cherries for this one. You're gonna grab it right there for the second one. And for the third one, you're gonna need four four um, cherries or four people. And you're gonna need to all jump on this level number four and um, it will bring you right up to the star. Now for the stamp, you're gonna actually need um, at least one other person and you can they can bounce you up and um, they're gonna bring you up there with the cherry power and you get your stamp. So now for the castle, this one's actually really easy. You're just gonna wanna grab the first star. It's right there in plain sight. For the second one, it's pretty easy as well. It's kind of in plain sight as well. You just break that box and it will be right there. So just like that. Now for the third one, you do need to get something at the beginning of the level. And you're gonna need to grab um, this thing right here. It's a cannon-like power thing and it shoots cannonballs. And you're gonna have to bring it to the end of the level. So as long as you have it towards the end of the level, you can destroy that, get that, and there you go. Now you're gonna need to get the stamp and that covers just about everything. The stamp's actually towards midway through the level. And and that's about all. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out my other ones. Um, I have World 1 and Let's Play Super Mario World Episode 1. So make sure to go check those out. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. This is Yosef Gaming signing out.